Hello, hello, hello! What's happening, everybody? MCOC Droid Does back again with another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. So I've got a lot of stuff to talk about in this video. It's uh, mostly Marvel Insider related, as you can see from the title, but quick little crystal update at the very end of it as well with a crystal to open also. But uh, first and foremost, sorry for not doing a usual Marvel Insider bundle breakdown video last month for October. I just, I kept putting it off, unfortunately, thinking I was going to have time, then I got super busy, and I just never was able to do it. So apologies for that. Um, I'm going to talk about the bundles really briefly a little bit later on in this video, since as you can see, they were delivered today. Uh, so definitely have a few things to talk about with that. And again, one crystal to open at the very least. But let's talk about November since we are in the middle of the month. Um, I'm kind of glad I waited not this long. I'm glad I waited at least a few days to talk about these bundles. But this still got delayed longer than it should have been. But uh, I'm able to do the catch up for October and talk about November all in one fell swoop. So let's go ahead and talk about some things with Marvel Insider as well. I mean, in case you missed it, in game there is no beginner event quest anymore. They got rid of that. So now there is only normal and up. So only normal and heroic are required for Marvel Insider points. So as you can see here, they have adjusted it accordingly. It's still 90,000 points total. You get the 35,000 for your first run of normal and 55,000 for your first run of heroic. Pretty straightforward. Um, business as usual, again, you know, just come on here. Put in your username, your in-game username, I should say, and you'll get the points. As I always like to say, if you plan on changing your name in-game, I always recommend you doing that first so that you know exactly what you need to put in over here in Marvel Insider. Remember, they got a match, or you could miss out on points, you could miss out on bundles, so just be careful there. Um, the usual 1,000 bonus points, it's been up for a few months now for the uh, monthly motion comic. There's always a special code that is in the description of the video on YouTube. So this month, as you can see, it is Monster. So type in Monster for the motion comic code panel right there under activities. That's another thousand points for you. So all of that is pretty straightforward. Again, um, haven't had the chance to cover the fact there is no beginner anymore. So it's same amount of points, but at least it's technically a little easier and quicker to get them done. Um, not the beginner was all that difficult, but you know, it's combined. So there you go. So this is why I'm actually kind of glad that I waited at least a few days um, to do this video. Again, not this late, but it is what it is. So this is the starter bundle. As always, it is the 30,000 points. Pretty straightforward there. It's the Hulk starter bundle. So I know uh, Frontline Dan and a couple other people, I have to go look, but uh, we, were, we were chatting right as these bundles went live, um, you know, on new event quest day and stuff like that. So as you can see here, it's a two-star Hulk. Okay. Um, Hulk Immortal is one of the two new champions of the month. Hulk Immortal is the, the icon for the bundle that you can see right there. So is it Hulk Immortal or is it Hulk? I am assuming at this point it is OG Hulk, which I believe I already have. Um, let's see. I do. Yeah, there we go. So, um, and he is Max. So I will get a Max Sig Crystal if I get this bundle. Um, so I would assume since it doesn't say Immortal... And if we jump ahead a little bit, the the uh, the bigger bundle does say that it's Abomination Immortal. Um, so I was already kind of assuming and pretty confident that it was going to be regular Hulk. And then a few days later, and most of us have already claimed this by now, I have been waiting all of this time to officially do it here in the video. Um, this, I don't have, I guess I could probably find the in-game message, but uh, there's this free digital comic offer that popped up. And sure enough, here is two star immortal hulk so again i would assume that the the uh the questing bundle let me pull it back up here actually i would assume that is going to be just regular old two star hulk which is still a rare champ uh for some people you know it still could be a new champ so that might be cool but uh of course for me it is not um but yeah so hopefully by now you've already claimed i can now finally officially do it and get it out of there uh your two star immortal hulk um, I think I probably still have the, let's see, it's, it's going to be somewhere in here. I guess I should have looked at the date of that and done the math. I, I actually, it might be gone actually. It might be too late, but anyway, uh, so we all got the, the two star Immortal Hulk for free, which is great. 
And then you will get OG Hulk here. You also get two two-star collector crystals, which is nice. Um, those, in case you uh, forget, do have champions that are not in the regular, you know, like premium hero crystals, regular two-star crystals. You're not guaranteed to get a rare champ, but you at least have a shot at it. And I know I'm still missing a fair amount. Um, not a fair amount, but, you know, there's still at least a handful or so of rare two-stars that I don't have. So hopefully I will be able to get at least one new one from those. You also get some level two health potions, level one solar revives, some energy refills, small energy refills, I should say, obviously not the full ones, and then a tiny bit of gold. So that is the usual 30,000 points. Moving here quickly, because again, there's still a lot to talk about, um, is the bigger bundle. This month it is another incursion bundle. We've seen one of these before, so this is the second time it's popped up. It's cool. It is a nice change of pace. I like that they at least brought out a different style of bundle uh, this year. Hopefully we will see new types of bundles or some new resources or what have you coming soon. Uh, but you do get to guarantee the three-star Abomination Immortal, which... Uh, I've done preview bundle crystals so far, and I've not gotten him. So at this rate, it will be a new champ, most likely. Um, you also get 2,000 incursion artifacts. Not a huge amount, but it's a nice uh, nice little boost right there. And then you get some incursion items. You get two level 2 revives, five level 3 potions, and five level 2 potions. So that's pretty cool if you're running uh, incursions on the regular those will absolutely come in handy, I'm sure. And then you also get five greater golden crystals. So those are the November bundles. Um, since obviously you can't get them at this point. So let me just very briefly go over the October bundles. Um, the starter bundle, starter bundle, excuse me, as you can see down here, the big get is a two star cosmic ghost rider, rare champ. Very cool. Um, I have to say that of course, it's nice to see both of the champions represented in the bundles last month. And you know, you can technically say that for this month as well, because we all got the two star immortal Hulk for free and then immortal abomination is in there so that is definitely covered as well so that's two solid months in a row let's keep it going absolutely please um for the questing bundle you get this generic two-star awakening gem a tier three oh no i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i was getting ahead of myself that is not a tier three uh class catalyst crystal that is a regular monsters and hunters crystal so i forgot i will have two things to open get a few solo revives solo potions and a few small energy refills the questing bundle had red goblin as a three star along with a generic three star awakening gem um the grandmaster monsters and hunter crystal which i will also open and we have to talk about that for a second um, you get some level two solo revives, some level three potions, and three full energy refills. It's pretty darn nice. I'm going to need those. Um, we've got completion running right now. I still need to do the four star challenge and the Cavalier event quest. So that's going to happen this weekend. So all this stuff will come in handy. Let me go ahead and claim both of them. Um, and I will open up those two uh, monsters and hunters crystals, but real quick first. And again, this is a mega video. <laughs> um, so in case you missed it, again, I've been busy these, you know, especially in the beginning part of uh, November and the end of October and stuff like that. So didn't really get to do that much content. I did sneak in a video. It's popping up in the corner right now. It was just like very under the radar where I opened up the collector crystals like from that special arena last month. And I opened up the Grandmaster monsters, crystals from the side quests and things like that. Uh, spoiler alert, I opened 19 of those Grandmaster crystals. I got, uh, I think it was what, like two four stars maybe? One or two four stars at the most, and everything else was three stars. I was very disappointed. Uh, there was a couple of days left in the event. I finished up whatever I needed to finish up, got just enough uh, stuff to turn in for one more Grandmaster crystal. So number 20, uh, didn't record it, of course, but... I did get a five star and lo and behold, it was abomination. Brand new five star abomination. Of course he is not, he's, he's a rare champ. You know, he's been in some random crystals here and there, but he's still not in like the five star basic crystal or the, the mystic science crystal or anything like that. So he's still a rare champ. I was very happy to at least get a five, one five star and 20 crystals. So hitting the odds, uh, right on it. But, um, but also the fact that it was a five star that I did not have. It was somebody brand new. 
Um, I've already got him awakened as a six star, but it's just the fact that I got the five star abomination. That was pretty cool. So, so, you know, I was, I was hoping that this one maybe would have to be the turnaround crystal. This is going to be number 21, but at this point it's fine. If it's not, <laughs> all of that was leading to say, I'm happy that I at least got a five star. I got a rare five star and I'm good. So I'm just going to, I'll spin these both out super quickly. I'm sure there are a couple of these champions that I still need as two stars. I didn't want to go through it all. Um, so let's see. Sentinel, I think I have. I'm pretty certain I have him as a two star. No, I don't. Look at that new champion. What is up? Thank you, Marvel Insider. <laughs> Oh, wow. This is already better than I thought it would be. Um, so that is a brand new two-star Sentinel. What is up? And yeah, so now I really don't care what... I mean, of course I care what I get from this, but I really don't care. Um, anything not a three-star would be great. That's automatically a win, but there is some... Any four-star, of course, is fine. Nothing specific there. If it was going to be a five-star... Um, thing would probably be the number one choice. It would awaken him. I could save a, a science gem, uh, man thing. That would be a first awakening. Tigra Tiger is in there. That would be a first awakening. So let's go. Um, really, uh, like I said, it's going to be fine no matter what it is. So just tap it in here. No need to spin it out all the way. This video has been quite lengthy as it is. Anything? Nah, just a three star rocket. That's fine. So that will do it. Uh, again, sorry for missing out on October's breakdown. I was able to sneak it in here. Bundles this month are looking great as well, especially if you run incursions. I highly recommend that uh, bigger bundle. Uh, I guess, you know, I'll throw them up here. Let's get this out of the way. Just a quick reminder of the two bundles. So this one is still fine. I mean, the collector crystals are really the only draws for me. I may skip it, but especially since I just pulled that Sentinel, I want to keep hunting for more rare two stars, so I'll probably end up getting it. This will be nice. Um, I will be getting this one as well. Definitely have plenty of points for it, so I'm not worried about it there. And speaking of points, um, be on the lookout sometime this weekend. I'm going to hopefully have it up on Saturday, but it may be Sunday, so keep an eye out. Um, and I know this video has been pretty long as it is. I apologize. But uh, I'm finally going to put together a video on this whole five gum thing that they have tied in with the... Uh, Marvel Avengers video game that's going on and the you know the Square Enix website and the codes and things like that I'm gonna go get some more I've got a little stack of uh, gum packages with codes in it so far to use on this website so I will be handing out a bunch just for free and like I said I'm gonna try and get a whole bunch more just to try and keep handing out as many as possible over the next month or so but uh, yeah look uh, look for that video again probably on Saturday maybe on Sunday we'll see how it goes for today, though, that'll wrap it up because that is plenty. Um, let me know. Did you get the October bundles? Are you going for the November bundles? Show off that super sexy two-star Cosmic Ghost Rider. I don't know why I'm scrolling all the way. I should just go to level up because, boom, there we go. Look at that. Multiple two-stars to level up. That doesn't ever happen anymore. Uh, but, yeah, let me know in the comments below how you're feeling about Marvel Insider last month, this month. Be sure to hit that like button, hit subscribe, ring the bell, turn on all notifications. All that stuff really helps me out, and I greatly appreciate it. For now, though, thank you so much for watching. Take care, and I will see you next time.